Hey all, Charlie here with Render Analytics. Today in Google Ads, we're gonna be looking at how to use A-B testing and experiments to improve your cost per conversion and your total conversion in sales. In order to access the experiments, you can be on your main overview and you wanna scroll down and click the experiments button and then all experiments. That will take you to this page. Today, we're going to be talking about building a custom experiment. So an experiment that you wanna have total control over the two different variations of your ads. The value of doing this type of work is by getting a higher conversion rate and a lower cost per conversion. The way A-B testing and experimentation works is you run multiple variations of the same ad at the same time and people randomly get assigned to one variation. And over time, you can measure if you have a statistically significant number of people who are users within your experiment, whether or not a particular ad can be improved based on a particular change or tweak to the ad. So today, we're gonna to do a custom experiment. We're gonna do a very common use case. We're gonna click new experiment here. We're gonna click custom experiment. We're gonna do this for search ads. We're gonna call this experiment max clicks versus max conversions. There's a classic conundrum, right? Which one's better for my business, clicks or conversions? Some most of the time, if you have good conversion tracking, max conversion is the way to go. But sometimes if maybe you're tracking phone calls or something like that, and you don't have sophisticated equipment, max clicks might be the way to go. Worry no more. You'll know once and for all definitively which one's better. So we're going to just assign this to a particular campaign. I'm going to click save and continue. Now what I'm going to do is for this experiment version of my campaign, I'm going to click settings, but this is the point in time where you can create any custom setting that you want. I'm going to click the campaign. I'm going to let it load here. It's basically a complete duplicate of your existing campaign, but I'm going to change one thing in this experiment. I'm going to change this from max clicks to max conversions. I can set a target cost per action if I want. I'm gonna click save. And just like that, I have a new variation of my experiment. And I'm going to now schedule my experiment to run. You can choose whatever metrics you want, but for me, I wanna see an increase in conversions and a decrease in cost per conversion, right? I wanna split my traffic up half and half between the experiments. I'm gonna run my experiment for let's say 20 days. Sometimes depending on the amount of traffic you want, you wanna at least have a, you can, one to 2,000 users in your experiment to really get a nice data set. Often more, the more data, the merrier. I wanna sync, so if I make any other changes on my other campaign in the meantime, it'll automatically apply those changes on this variation as well. So the only change between them, even if I make changes to either ad, will be the max conversions versus max clicks. I click create experiment. Just like that, my experiment is getting created and live and it will be underway. At the end of the experiment, I can then decide whether or not I want to apply the change to the entirety of my ad, or if the experiment did not produce a, a benefiting change, in which case I can start working on my next experiment and take the, the information and move on. Hope this is helpful, guys. Uh, if you want to learn more about PPC services or Google Ads generally, check us out at renderanalytics.net.